today specifically, we've been invited to Hockey Day in Canada, uh, a great privilege for the uh, Royal Air Force Aces. And we came and arrived in Edmonton last Saturday, took on the Oilers game, and they've had uh, some sessions on the ice all week with training, four games, uh, a down day yesterday to recover. Uh, I've got two guys holding injury, so they won't be playing today. And then uh, up to this game here where the guys are fired up. They're really fired up for this game. And so were the Cold Lake Packers. From the initial puck drop, their superior skill level was obvious as they started off scoring and continued to dominate the game and run up the scoreboard to a 7-0 lead in the first period. They wanted to you know, see how we play the game. So that's the way we played the first period. It was you know, take them to school, show them how we play the game, and then you know, just have some fun with them afterwards. Right? So. As you can see by the score, we're going to play for the draw and hopefully get a replay back in the UK. That's what we're looking to get. Let's just say out of diplomatic courtesy, the Canadian team stopped counting after eight goals. All in all, the UK team says the chance to play together against a foreign team has given them some new skills to take home. The, the team essentially is made up of players from all over the UK, so we don't naturally train or play together. So it's an opportunity to, to blend and to, to hone our skills, if you like, you know, those that we've got. And um, this is an opportunity to, to take that back to the UK. And then when we go into competition against the Army and the British Navy, then hopefully we'll come on top. In Cold Lake, Coraline Jarvis, New Cap News.